okay gonna do a quick video this is about the hertz shelby um gt rental i just got it for the past three days so far so good you see the hertz badging on it you got the dual exhaust i'm gonna do a little startup for you in a minute this model right here is gonna be the convertible so i'm gonna do a quick walk around and just give you a little idea of what i got cost me about i believe it's about 800 dollars for seven days got the pretty burgundy now i will say this i had a white one initially and it was not in good shape so i took it back and they replaced it with this guy which i liked a lot better the color is more of my alley convertible top pinstripe again you got the hertz badging nice little fog lights very muscular nice looking car um one thing i will say as well if, if you're looking for something to pill out with they're not going to you're not going to be able to pill out in this car like that um you'll accelerate after like third or fourth year but i don't know if they got a chip in it or whatever that's going to prevent it from doing that because they know people may want to just get it for fun but okay you get the hertz badging inside the wheel well as well so now i'm going to show you i got the auto start crank it up for you let's see how this girl sounds just gonna press lock and twice so it growls now I'm gonna show you how, cause you might have some people like me that wanted to know how to lower the roof. Um, I'm gonna show you how to do that real quick. Alrighty. Uh, so getting in the car, now that the auto starts, you're gonna put your foot in the brake, press start, lights it up, smash. So with the convertible top, all you have to do is there's a lever right here guy right here you pull it down you twist it there's gonna be a little button right here so that way you'll be a pro by the time you get it right you push this back the windows let down and the top goes see the rear view mirror that's simple now one other thing i'm gonna show you is you got different modes so let me see here's this button right here i don't know if you can see it but you have your modes you have your steering traction hazards so if you need hazards what I like to do I'm gonna go to mode and I like to put it in track so you got normal right there sports plus you got track you also have like drag strip wet snow it goes and then you got normal again me personally I like to put it in track and I let it rip. Okay, so now it's in track mode. And when you're in track mode, it's not gonna let you change your steering because it automatically changes to accommodate you for that track mode. But that's basically it in a nutshell, guys. Um, it's a nice car, I like it. Again, you're not gonna be able to do any type of peeling out at the um, at green light if that's what you're thinking about doing. Maybe some modifications, but it's very sporty. I like it, my wife, we like it for a little getaway car for vacation. All right, so hope that helps.